Whoa, what? How did that not capture you? Oh, what? Oh! What? Oh no! What is happening? Today I went searching in the redwoods and I found exactly what I was hoping to find. Oh, 135. Hello. Okay, I gotta kill that one. Also, I technically can't even go out and team that right now. Uh, hmm. Yeah, I've been searching around here trying to see if I could clear up some Thylas because I keep finding so many low levels. Um, how many have I killed? They give two each, so I've killed, what is that, like eight then? Uh, yeah, so we've been just killing a bunch of Thylas, uh, trying to clear them all up to properly try to get some good ones. And, uh, yeah, there we go. 135 is definitely very, very good. Is that another Thyla down there? Hang on. What did I just see? That's a level 50. Okay, we'll go ahead and kill that one real quick. So, yeah, I just wanted to search around just see if I could find one because I didn't want to try and start a video unless I could actually potentially get something. Um, but then when I realized after being out here for a little bit, I'm actually going to probably need some uh, of the top tier of kibble, which I do not have right now. Wait, where did they go? Weren't they just on that tree right there? Hang on. Do they jump off already? Oh, no. I don't know where it went. Oh, is that it there? No, that's a level 15. Dude, there's a lot of Thylas around here. Okay, right there. I think that's either it or that's going to be the level 10. It was on that tree right there. So, I don't know. Maybe I should grab it out of here then. I don't know if I feel comfortable leaving it here. What do I have? I think I grabbed something. Okay, this is uh, not Thylas, but yeah, we'll just kill all these guys. Almost looks like a freaking Alpha Carno. There we go. We got a Thyla here. What level's that? Level 10. Okay. I think the 135 is that other one. All right. We got this one killed. Uh, where's the other one? You. Let me grab you. Nice. Okay. There we go. Um, I don't know what we're going to do with this thing. We're going to have to bring it back and, and put it somewhere or something. Because right also, I do not have the stamina for this. Damn. Okay. Hang on. Right now, we do not have the kibble to be able to do this. And unless I want to try and see if somebody else has it. Then I guess this is what, oh no, this is what we're going to go ahead and try to do. Maybe I could sneak in and see if, uh, see if somebody else has got some. That could be kind of fun because it's either that or I go around trying to team up some Uteranuses. Hmm. We might, uh, we might try and see if we can steal some kibble from somebody. Maybe somebody's left a door or something open and I can get in. Hello. No, don't. Don't you dare. Alrighty, well anyway, yeah, we're taming up this Thyla here today. 135 is pretty good. It's not absolutely fantastic, but I will definitely take it. Um, it's at least close to max level, so that's pretty uh, good for me. I cannot, like, let me regen my stamina, bro. Really? Hang on, there we go. Um, okay, I'm, I'm kind of curious. Like, should I just leave it here and just assume that it's going to be here later? I guess we can. I, I'm just going to have to because I, I can't really bring it anywhere. I don't have like a taming trap. I thought it was going to stay on the tree, but I guess it jumped off after something at some point. So, yeah. Um. All right. Where do we want to go then? Evo's base is a little bit in this direction. And I feel like, I don't know. I feel like he might have kibble. I know Axe is online right now. We could probably go over and bother him and see if he's got some. Hmm, yeah, this could be the thing. We're gonna go steal some kibble so I can go ahead and get the Styla all teamed up. Guys, go ahead, do me a favor, hit the like button if you enjoyed this one. Hopefully this works out for us, because this would be a lot more entertaining than actually taming up a bunch of low-level Uteranuses to get some kibble. But, um, yeah, we'll hopefully try to get this done. We'll see. By the way, yes, I do know that I could use some lamb chops, but I don't believe it gives you the full effectiveness, right? I'm pretty sure it doesn't. So I do want to use the kibble anyway, um, just to be sure. Lamb chops are better than mutton for Thylas. Every single time I mention that, people try to tell me that it's not. I, you could look it up. <laughs> oh my God. Oh man, I've had so many videos where I like use the lamb chops and people were like, no, mutton. And it's like, no, that's, that's not how it works, man. I, I'm sorry. I don't know what to tell you. <laughs> I don't make the rules. I just, I follow them, I guess. Um, anyway, we'll, uh, we'll head on over to Evo's base. We're kind of close by. He's, um, he's a little bit further in this direction, kind of at the edge of the redwoods at the end of this river. Yeah. So Evo didn't have any, so we're just going to skip ahead. All right. Well, you know what? I might as well make this trip actually worthwhile and we'll bring back some of these stupid dodos that he keeps leaving in my base. There was one uh, a little while ago, and eventually when we turned off offline uh, raid protection, I did kill it. 
And then there was two more like last week and I did record a clip of that, but I just scrapped all that footage and uh, obviously it died with that. But now there's four. So instead of killing them, I'm just going to return them. Maybe that's what he wants. Maybe he wants these weird facts about dicks or whatever it is. I have no idea what they are. So yeah, we'll uh, we'll go ahead and just <laughs> we'll just drop these off and, and pretend that this is a friendly ex exchange and we'll uh, maybe bowl him or and, and something. I don't know. We might knock him out. I have no idea. No kind of plans here. I just kind of want to scope out his base a little bit. That is a gorgeous RG. I really want that. Anyway. Uh, yeah, so he lives pretty much over the other side of this mountain, super close to me. Um, I think he just really wanted to live really, really close to where I was living, in all honesty. So, yeah, uh, I can't blame the guy, you know? My base is so gorgeous. Anyway, uh, <laughs> he lives, like, right down here. We're pretty much almost there. I do actually have a good idea for a, uh, funny little prank that I might end up pulling at some point here. Um, I'm not gonna spoil what it is, and in all, in all honesty, I kind of almost don't want to even spoil it in a video. I don't know. We'll see. Let me just go ahead and drop back these uh, these dodos here. Does he have any Uteranuses? That is the main question that I want to answer right now. If he does, that means that he probably has the top tier of kibble. And if he doesn't, then I don't know. He does have flags for the uh, for the bosses, actually. Here we go. Maybe we can steal those. Let's see, does he have any Uteranuses? It doesn't look like it. Damn. Okay. Crap, nobody does. Am I like the only one? He's got a Thyla though. Maybe I can steal his Thyla. Wait, can I just like pick up people's creatures and fly away with them? That could be a thing. Does that actually just work? <laughs> there he is. I just bought him on the ground there. <laughs> no, I'm just messing. I'm not, I'm not gonna steal it. Here you go. Here you go. Here you go. Enjoy. Tell him I'm returning some Dodos. Okay, that is a lot of Baryonyxes. Oh, he's got some nice mutations in there. There's a nice purple one. I'm trying to protect the Barrys, guys. He really wants to kill them. I don't know about this. Wait, are those Barrys? Oh, yeah, they are Barrys. Okay, I thought for a second they might be Spinos. Okay, well. I'm gonna have to stop this. <laughs> just completely just ruining his video. <laughs> Let me put him up here. Bye. Alrighty, well, he doesn't have any and nobody else does. I'm pretty sure Jim doesn't, so I'm just going to accept my fate and uh, look for some Uteranuses out in the wild. <sighs> that is, it's gonna be such a pain. The best part is that I don't have to, like, you know, try to efficiently tame them. I just need to knock them out, and if they get hurt after, as long as they don't die, it's all good. Um, yeah, so we'll, uh, we'll just try and look for the lowest of the low. And, uh, you know what? In all honesty, we kind of just need one male and one female for the moment as well. I can actually just use the fertilized eggs to turn into kibble too. So yeah, let me, uh, let me take a little look out here. We'll see if we can find some. All right, well, we've got a level 35 one here. I don't know how hurt it is because it's already fully red. But, uh, we do need to uh, kill that 135 mammoth and never mind. We'll just let the mammoth have it because there's no way. Um, all right, let me keep searching then. Ooh, level five. Okay, I'll take that one. That's kind of perfect, actually. Oh, crap. We did just get fear roared, though. <laughs> oh, no. And I can do things again. Ugh, God, I hate the fear roar. All right, uh, where even was that thing? Oh, I think it was over here, right? Maybe? Is it dead? It might actually be dead. I see the RG, I think. I'm pretty sure it was, like, right here. Oh, yeah, there it is. There you are. Look at you. All right, um, we'll just see if I can knock it out, like, right around here. I, I do have trap stuff, but I don't even know if that's necessary. It's only level five. We should be able to do this super, super quick, maybe, possibly. Ooh, we avoided that fear roar somehow. Okay, nice. Definitely should not be out on here on something that can get immediately fear roared, but it is what it is. Let's see, there it is. Okay, you didn't hit me with that. Maybe I'm immune for a little bit. Oh, crap. We're okay. <laughs> let me uh, let me get down here. Let me have this thing follow me, possibly. No, it doesn't want to. Yeah, the uh, the path finding... Path following. There we go. Now we are fear road again. <laughs> God, this is going to be annoying. I don't know if I... Maybe I can, like, leave you over here. Oh, okay. That's kind of perfect, actually. Let me let me go ahead and kill this guy. Is, is he going to come to me? What the hell? What's that Carno doing? He just like stood there for a second. He just like eyed me up a little bit. And now he's running. Okay, we will totally be able to do this, but this Carno has got to like figure out what he wants to do. There we go. He wants to attack. That's fine. Perfect. Yeah. Well, this uh, this Uteranus is in a perfect spot to try and do this in. And now it is moving out of that spot at lightning speed. We love to see it, folks. Let's go ahead and do that. 
just pop in a bunch of arrows. It's only level five. It's not going to take that many. There we go. Now it's out. That's all I needed. I just needed a time where it could not fear or me. Nice. All right. Well, <laughs> it looks so not good there. Oh, wow. All right. Um, I have a little bit of prime here, but I think for the moment, I don't know. That, that could be enough. I guess I could just put the normal meat on it as well. We will actually have to walk this thing back now. I'm just realizing that is probably the worst part about the fact that we don't have um, thingies in the game yet. Cryopods. They're coming soon, folks, but I don't know when. Um, can we... Okay. Not from there, apparently. From here. Nice. And let's do that. Cool. Alrighty. Well, there we go. We got some uh, food on it. We'll just have to wait for it to get tamed up now. It's not really going to take super long, but I will continue my search. We just need one female, and then we're good to go. All you need is just Eutyranuses for the top tier of Kibble. You don't need high-level ones. You don't need... A bajillion of them, you know, just two to start with, male and female. So we've got a Titanosaur here, and we've got another one right up there that looks like freaking Godzilla or something. That one there is beautiful. <laughs> but, like, why are they so close, dude? Like, what the hell's happening? I, um, I don't know. I don't like that. I don't like that at all. In fact, actually, when we do have some Thylas, not today, not today at all, but once we do have some decent level Thylas with, um you know, some good stats and some really high health and some, some really good saddles. Eventually, when we have the good ones, we can start killing some titanosaurs because, um, yeah, Thylas are fantastic at killing them because of their bleed. You know, you just keep bleeding them and then eventually you're going to have to try and hit them or something, bite them or whatever, just to get those last few hits in because if they die by the bleed, it doesn't count as an actual kill. It doesn't get credited. So, yeah, it's a really great way of getting yourself a... Uh, a nice little uh, massive amount of XP because they're like crazy massive amounts. I think it's like 30,000 or something like that. Um, but yeah, really cool. Also, it's very satisfying just in general. Anyway, still looking around for some more Eutyranuses. I found a couple more males, no females so far. Uh, did find a level 10 male, so we could have tamed that one if this one didn't work out. But there we go. We got that one. Maybe with this next one, I'll try to, like, get it from a distance or something, and then, like, by the time it gets to me, if it's a low level, it might end up already being knocked out, so could be a thing. Oh, I hear one. Dude, you actually hear them before you see them. <laughs> where, where is it? There it is. Somewhere. Uh, is it in that cluster? Oh, it's a female, level 105. Eh, not... Now, what, really what we're looking for, I'll look around here. Maybe if, if I can't spot another one, then we could probably just tame that one because it would mean that I don't have to go super far away from where I am right now. <laughs> that is, that's the main reason. Let me get up here. Let me see if I can do this. It's totally going to fear war my RG though. That's the only issue. That is definitely going to happen. Um, maybe if I put you back here, if I sit forward over here, we might be able to do this. Where is the Uteranus? Very, very awkward spot to do this in. Oh, it's running over here now. Like, it's around here somewhere. Oh, there it is. Okay, yeah, it never went with the Carnos. It doesn't uh, like its new Carno friends. Let's see. Am I floating? Okay, I actually am. Oh, oh, oh! What the hell? Why was... What was that terrain? Uh, let me up. Huh? What the hell was that terrain? I was like still on it, but I fell. Oh, that could have been so bad. Also, I really should have switched my armor before coming out here. <laughs> I switched to the ghillie so we can mess with uh, Axe, but it didn't really work out super well for us, did it? Uh, let's do that. Let's do that. And uh, let me get back up here. That was terrifying. I just slipped right off the edge, even though I was technically still on the land. Look at that, look. <laughs> what the hell is that? Like. Look at this. I can stand here, but then it just turns into a sheer cliff right there. And it's not visually, it's, it doesn't match the visuals at all. That's terrifying. Um, anyway, <laughs> we'll see if we can continue this one. I don't know if we will. We got our Uteranus, our male. Uh, hmm. You know what? I'm just realizing it. This is a really silly thing to do, but we could probably just breed them out here. Bring the eggs home. <laughs> that way I won't even have to walk them back. <laughs> Okay, if I take another tumble down this cliff, we're totally going to die. So let's hope that that doesn't happen. I've just realized I actually have some medical brews on me. Again, another thing that I brought just in case we'd have a little confrontation with Axe. Um, 
We almost had one. He he was ready to he was ready to mess me up. Well, attempt to. I don't think he actually could have. Um, <laughs> yeah, he uh he was he was ready to to start to start trying to get a little warfare going because I tried to stop him from killing all those babies. I'm just I'm just trying to be a good guy, you know. Just trying to look out for the babies. I, I cannot hit that thing at all. Let me get a couple more medical brews on here just to try and heal. Yeah, I can't. I cannot do it. I really can't. Uh, let's see. Let me get over here. Okay, we got two of them. There should be like one more left, but it's going to be a little hard to get that one when I don't know where it went. Um, you Tyrannus wise, no idea where that thing went. Is that it way over there? That is not it way over there, right? What? Really? You, f you like, ran all the way over to here to see my other Euteranus, to see your new mate. <laughs> That's the same one, right? It's gotta be. I mean, what the hell? Why? Why did you do this? Hang on. Do I need to help you? Let's see. Let me just spyglass a little bit okay that's only level five but there's the level 140 rhino attacking it god damn it you know like this is it guys like people keep saying oh how do you keep getting all the high levels uh it's gonna totally kill that utranus isn't it these things are just around i don't know what to tell you just look for them <laughs> that's a really bad attitude towards it but i don't know man like i don't know this look they're just here i don't know i don't know what to tell you um we're not gonna tame up that rhino we got other plans today you look super hurt we really need to just get you knocked out if possible that's not gonna hit ah yeah i'm gonna have to probably try to kill these rhinos it killed one of them are you coming for me now bro really hang on yeah, they're gonna kill it they're gonna kill that utranus for sure okay we got that one that 140 rhino is gonna mess him up so much recoil on this thing i don't even know okay I, no i got it oh wait that was a 120 there was a 140 right i think or did I miss, uh, see it? I thought it was, oh yeah, you're fully healed now. Nice. Uh, yeah. Let's see if we can do this then. Will you just go down, please? There we go. Got it. Nice. Cool. All right. Let's, uh, let's get over to Nova. Do I have any food to put onto you? No, just, it would make it easier for tracking. I think I should be able to find it though. Alrighty. Well, we got that Uteranus. We got this Uteranus. I think what we will actually end up doing is we're just going to breed out a couple eggs around here. And you know what? We'll just bring them back and hatch them. And if they're all male and female, then that's perfect. Um, <laughs> that would mean I don't have to walk them all the way back home because we are a decent distance. It doesn't look like that far, but through all wolves and everything, I just feel like it wouldn't happen for us. You know, I just really feel like we wouldn't get that good look. So yeah, let me, uh, let me go ahead and focus on killing some stuff to get some uh prime going here we go we got some prime off of you actually nice we got a little bit of prime off you too that's more maybe not more than enough never mind uh yeah let me let me see where is this utranus though all right well i finally got this thing tamed up we're bringing it over to the mail and we're just gonna make a bunch of babies like i said just because again like trying to bring that low level mail through the snow I don't know if that's gonna work you know it could easily end up dying um and then i'd be back to square one so this way i don't have to risk that and uh yeah i could just fly back back to base or whatever after this and i'm gonna have a bunch of eggs to hatch up there we go we've already got one all right so we've got three Uteranus eggs i'm really hoping that we get a male and a female at least okay we've got a female do we have a male we do nice okay please also be a female that would be great Ah, uh, nice. Two females, one male. That's exactly what we needed. Okay, we just gotta wait for them to grow up now, which is gonna take a little bit, so... Yeah, let me, uh... I don't know where I'm gonna put them. We're gonna have to have them somewhere. Hmm, maybe upstairs. I don't know. Okay, so yeah, we have enough in here to craft 12. By the way, I love that they increased the amount of water that's in here, because, oh, God, it was such a pain before. You weren't able to, like, craft, or, like, I guess, queue up more than 10 things at a time. And it was the worst thing ever. So it's a really good thing that they actually did this. Because, uh, yeah, that was really, really painful before. But there we go. We have our kibble now. We've got 12 of it, which is more than enough to tame up one Thyla. So I'm going to have more that I can potentially use at some other stage to tame up some more Thyla. So, yeah, we'll, we'll see what we can kind of get. It has been many, many hours since the, um, since the time when we actually did find that one. So I don't know if it's even going to still be there. So we're going to have to take a look. Let me see. Let me chuck this crap away. 
All right, so we're roughly back over where the Thyla was. Again, don't know if it's going to still be here. Really should have just tamed it up with uh, Lamb Chops, eh? This whole, like, goose chase of, like, the Uteranuses and everything. Oh, man. So much unnecessary stuff. I really should have just tamed it with the uh, Lamb Chops anyway. It lost a couple levels. Ah, oh, man. It's all good. Let's see. Um, Obviously, this area hasn't really been loaded in. I don't know if Axe came over here at all. I know he was on, like we saw earlier, but I think he logged off a long time ago. So, yeah. Um... Don't see the Thyla. Not right now. Oh, is that a little baby Bronto? Look at you, little guy. Hello. Beautiful colors. Kind of crazy looking colors. All right, let's see. Um, Let's have a little look around, see if we can spot this thing. It was roughly in this. That actually might be it right there. No, level 15. Okay, we'll pick that thingy up and kill it. Come here. Come to me. Oh, we didn't pick you up. I picked something else up. I picked up a compi, I think. All right, let's see. Let's get you. Come on. Here you go. Enjoy. Alrighty. So yeah, level 135 is what we're looking for. It is unfortunately a little bit darkish right now, so not going to be the easiest thing to spot. I think it had like really dark colors as well, actually. Once again, saving you some time by saying that I searched around everywhere and it's not there. And it's unfortunate, but don't worry. We got something better coming up. On the positive side, I am finding a lot of thylas. Like that's, that's definitely, oh, there's another one over there. That's definitely a good thing. Unfortunately, a lot of them seem to be... Whoa, what? how did that not capture you? Oh, what? Oh! What? Oh no! What is happening? Oh crap. Uh, hang on. Melee? Melee's probably better. What the hell just happened there? Oh, they have a new effect? I'm dead. Oh, there's so many terrors. This is just not fair. I'm, I'm pantsless now. Okay, yeah, this is death. Yeah, I'm dead. I thought I had more health potions there. What the hell? I mean, that's kind of annoying. <laughs> oh, that kind of sucks. Yeah, we're going to have to fly back over there now. Yeah. All right. Well, I guess it's... I thought I grabbed him, and then it... I, I don't know. I, I definitely should have grabbed them there. <laughs> oh, that sucks. I think they broke all my armor as well, but it's it's whatever. Um, We need another RG. Let's bring you. Come on, Agent Travis. The brand new one. The one with all the weight. Now, the question is, will I be able to get back to Nova without running out of stamina? That is definitely the question. Also, if I get Thylid right now, I'm going to be really upset because there was that other one, and I don't know where the tree was from this direction um i think did i just oh no okay that's nova cool hang on let's see i think the other tree was like yeah there it is it's, it's over there cool all right let me get nova we'll uh we'll kill that one thyla holy crap we gotta also make sure it didn't magically go back up a tree because you know that could happen allegedly um okay i don't see any the all like the worry that I always have is like, is it gonna be on the back of a tree that I'm flying by? And in that case, like you know, you can't be checking every single tree in every single uh, direction. I don't know. It's just uh, it's a little too much. I I saw that coming. Get away. There we go. We good? I think we're okay now. All right, there we go. We lost a little bit of armor, not all of the armor. Not bad. All right. Um, I don't know where that Thyla went. Did I kill it? I can't even remember. Let's at least get that level 10, wherever the hell that thing was. Um, it was over here, I think. Just gonna watch out. There's a lot of trees around here. Just gotta, like, at least keep an eye on them. It's got event colors and everything. Why do you have such a terrible level? Oh, it's got, like, purple on it and everything, dude. That's awesome looking. There we go. That's what I wanted to do earlier, but it just didn't happen. There we go. Oh! That's a one four. I'll take it. I'll take it. Level 10 plus 135. That's how that one got created. <laughs> yes! 
Oh, man. It doesn't have event colors, but that's all good. Whereabouts is it? Oh, my God. That thing's so low on the tree. Oh, what? I was above you! Can I get off of me? I was above you! I don't want to hit it with the freaking hatchet, though. I'm getting attacked by two of them now. Bro, I was above you. How the hell? Why? I can't even see. Yeah, I'm dead. <laughs> I seriously just died to the one I'm going to tame. There's one with a Tranodon. Did you see that? He had that Tranodon with him. Bro, come on now. That's twice. Ah. <laughs> just having terrible luck in this specific area. I've spent the whole day looking for Thylas. And... And in this very specific area, not only is there tons of them, but they're also able to just constantly kill me. So that's cool. Love that. <laughs> I'm gonna have to bring back three freaking RGs now. God damn it. Ah, that's such a pain. Uh, it is what it is. At least we have a 145. What is happening as well? Like, is there something weird about those trees very specifically? Because I have not had issues at all picking them off the trees. I, like throughout the whole day but right now like in that area just major major issues also i was above him that shouldn't count that really shouldn't count but it is what it is whatever we have a 145 and an army of rgs to bring home but yeah there we go <laughs> i mean if i can get it i you know it, it might i definitely didn't kill it i was accidentally hitting it with the hatchet i didn't realize i pulled out my hatchet i thought i was going to be punching it but then i noticed the damage numbers oh man yeah all right well Hopefully we can manage to get this thing because that that's gonna be it one four five. That's perfect uh, is moving around What are you doing in the air Nova? You fighting? What are, what's happening? What's what's going on here? Oh They're following each other. Okay, that makes sense All right, uh, I need to swap on to Nova because uh, she's he or my Nova's got the most stamina um, Do you look at those freaking shadows of the Archies down there? That's crazy looking yeah, we'll, uh, we'll swap on to Nova. We'll try and get my stuff, and then we'll go for, um, we'll go for the Thylas. They should be, like, roughly where I died. Hopefully they don't mount trees again somehow. Again, seriously don't even know if that's possible. Like, I've never seen it happen. And I, I honestly get a lot of comments that are just completely false. I don't know where people get some of this information sometimes. It's very odd. But, yeah, on the odd occasion, I'll get, like, a comment where it's like, oh, yeah, did you know that this and this and this and it's just like that's not even a thing <laughs> i don't know uh so i don't know let me know if that's a thing then please let me know because that would be cool to know um i've never seen it happen Th that's definitely some new thylas for sure right oh. <laughs> can they go up now is this a thing can they dive upwards? I think I heard... I, I I think I saw something in the patch notes about Thyla's being changed, but I didn't know that they could go upwards. It's, that's not actually a thing, though, right? Did, did they change them? Like, uh, I'm so confused. This is not normal. They literally went upwards. How the hell? That hasn't happened at all today. How has that not happened at all today? And then we have issues in this specific area. They're evolving. <laughs> oh my God, dude, what the hell? Maybe it's because I've been appro- Do we just get jumped out again? Maybe it's because I've been approaching from like so high up with only one RG. Look at that. What the hell? Yeah, it's definitely because I have more than one RG with me. Um, I think at least. I don't really know. Where's that 145 now? Yeah, it's, it's definitely got to be the fact that these two are following me because, like, this doesn't happen at all today. Am I about to get run up on by something? I feel like it's safe. All right, well, it was a good idea to come back to the scene of the crime. I got it. <laughs> it was, like, right beside where I died. All right, nice. So we just need to survive this trip home, and hopefully it won't bleed me to death. Um... There we go. It's no longer biting. That's good. Let me just go grab my RGs and I see one of them. Oh, I see the two. Okay. I, I can see the blue one. Is, is that one going to come? What the hell's wrong with you? Okay. There we go. There we go. It's uh, it's no longer biting me. That's that's a plus. 
Um, we will have to drop it at some point before we get all the way home, I think. Maybe? Yeah, probably. All right, so we did manage to get back. That is a beautiful RG. We did manage to get back with a full thing of Stam. We still got, uh, like, 300 left, so we're pretty good. Um, unfortunately, right now, we have my RG following me, and then another one in the back, and then three wild RGs following that one, so that's not great. Right here, I've got my little trap. We're just gonna drop you in here. I think you should be okay. Nice, yeah. It shouldn't be able to get out of that little gap right there, where I have the, um... What do you call it? The little gate frame thingy. The billboard. We should be good. Um, all right. Let's pop the crossbone here. Yeah, it shouldn't be able to fit through here, but on the off chance that it does, I will die. <laughs> let's see. Let's put you guys on the passive. Also, stop following me, please. It's just standing there. What? Can you not see me or something? I'm so confused. Oh, okay. You're doing things. What is happening? <laughs> Dude, what is this game lately? Oh, man. I don't understand. Come on, bro. You and me. I'm gonna eventually make a new mystique, maybe, possibly, so you could be the beginnings of it. Come on. You know what? We might... Uh, I don't know if it's, like, hurt. It might be a little bit hurt, because I technically was hitting it in the face with a hatchet earlier. It's not something that Thylas enjoy, by the way, just in case you didn't know that. Uh, here we go. Are you gonna... Okay. No idea what's happening there. Yeah, we'll just hit it with a couple darts just in case. It's so hard to see in there. It gets so dark when I stand back here. Hit you with a couple more arrows instead. Um... Yeah, I have no idea. I mean, at this point, it's definitely Torpor running, if anything. But, like, what the hell was happening earlier? Did I, like, book it out? Is it, maybe it was still aggroed onto my RG or something? I don't know. That's very confusing, though. All right, well, there we go. We got it all knocked out. Um, what the hell? Is that my bird? Okay, cool. I thought maybe we had some wild ones making some noise. I probably need to kill these ones or something, just in case. Um, Let's see. Let me go ahead and just chuck in some kibble. We'll just put in five for the moment. I don't know how much it's actually going to take. I never even looked it up, but um, yeah. Let's see. We've got you. Let me just bring you guys down below. Oh, crap. Let me grab that. Wait, how many did I get back? Oh, I need an extra one. Damn it. <laughs> I was like a second too late there. Ah, it's okay. That melee damage does not look good. Just going to say that straight off the bat. That does not look very good at all. Um, well, there we go. We got a Thyla. I mean, a 1, 4, 5. Like, that's, that's better than 1, 3, 5. Definitely happy with that. Okay, Mastercraft's pretty good. Let's see. Do we have a blueprint, though? Um, I have a blueprint that will end up being better if I crafting skill. But we'd also have to spend all those materials. I'm just going to use this one for the moment. Yeah, we, we can eventually make a better one or find a better one or whatever. But there we go. We got a Thyla. I'm going to wait till it's daytime and we'll head out and do some stuff, but it is only coming into the nighttime now, unfortunately. All right, so I'm just out and about with the Thyla trying to collect up some levels. It almost looks like we've got like purple or something on the back, actually. Maybe it's just the red mixing with it. It actually almost does look purple. Is that purple? Let's see. Um, It definitely doesn't look like a normal natural color, but it might just be the red mixing with it. I don't really know. Right now, there's no way. Yeah, it definitely it doesn't look like purple back here. It definitely is like the red mixing with it. Oh, God, that looks awful. Um, Yeah, right now, there's no easy way to be able to tell the colors on the creatures unless you have like a mod. So, you know, hopefully the cryopods come in soon because then we'll actually be able to tell what color our creatures are, like the actual color values and everything. Maybe stats, too. I really hope they update them to the point where they have the actual stat points as well because I don't see the point of not including that stuff. But anyway, yeah, we're out and about. Uh, is that another Alpha Carno? I just killed one. It was a level 5, though, so I didn't... That's a level 10. Really? Okay, cool. <laughs> They're just terrible, I guess. Um, yeah, we're just out and about on this thing. I just wanted to get a couple levels just to begin, and uh, we're collecting up a ton of hide and pelt and everything, and a good amount of chitin whenever I can find a scorpion. So, yeah, having a Thyla is going to make things so much better going forward. Let's go ahead and uh, maybe try to kill that Alpha Carno over here. Let's kill this guy first, though, obviously. Um, yeah, so 
anyway, I, I think going forward, I, I need to get more of them. I need to get some better stats, 100%. I need to start my mutations on them. I need to... I need to just get more of them. So I was kind of thinking maybe a good little project to do would be... Oh, crap. I'm taking a lot of damage from that. Wow. Okay. Ooh, how much health do I have? Okay. Yeah, we can fight it for a little longer, but it's making me bleed and it's also hitting me and everything just hurts right now. Um, yeah, a good project to, prob to probably get done at some point soon would potentially be some sort of taming pen in the Redwoods. And I was kind of thinking we could do it on top of like a, um, a platform. And if we did that, that way I'd have like a taming pen in the middle of the map that I could just go to if I wasn't anywhere near my base. And um, yeah, we can maybe also leave some kibble there as well or something. Oh, I didn't get credit for the kill. No. Ah, oh, that sucks. Yeah, it is what it is. But yeah, if, if I had like a, a fridge there or something, I could leave some kibble there. And um, yeah, I don't know. I just feel like something like that could be really, really useful. So we might actually, we might try and do that at some point soon. I think that could be pretty cool. It might have to be a metal platform though. So it's going to be quite expensive if we do that. But eventually, you know, when we have rhinos and everything, we'll be able to like drop Rexes into there and that would be huge. So yeah, we, we got we to gotta gear up. We got to do some big stuff like that. So I think we might attempt that maybe in the next episode or something. We'll see. But um, another thing I want to actually try and do as well is uh, maybe try to get ourselves a Quetzal here. Because I feel like if we had one, you know, they may not seem that useful nowadays. But <laughs> I, I've, I've read up on the cryopod changes and you need to have a cryo fridge near your um near when you are actually dropping out your creatures so i think everybody's just gonna start putting them onto platform saddles and flying around with quetzals as they're like little uh flying around creature pretty much i i don't know what else to call that um, <laughs> you know because like if if we can drop out whatever from a quetzal if we have the um the cryo fridge on top of it then i feel like that's definitely gonna be the best thing to be running around this whole map with they're super slow that's the only issue i am also very very hurt i know i'm not trying to die here don't worry i might actually just get away because that megatherium does not look any redder than it already was uh no it does okay we'll kill it real quick let's do it come on come on let me get you no 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 i'm i'm gonna leave <laughs> that is way too uh low on the health there um oh he, we actually killed him never mind okay cool it is what it is <laughs> we didn't get the kill oh man uh yeah he bled out mm, yeah if we don't have anything else good in here okay well yeah we we might try and do that at some stage soon a quetzal uh maybe also a taming pen and then we could just start taming these things all the time you know just dropping them in whenever i'm finding them other things too i mean having something in the very middle of the map seems like the smartest option so i might try and do that um, maybe I could start grinding out for today and then just working on it and, uh, getting that done for the next episode, uh, or in the next episode. We'll make it an episode. Don't worry. I won't just do it between videos, but, um, yeah, so we might try and do that. That definitely would be super useful and, um, it would have been super useful today, but maybe not that useful because I feel like the Thyla still would have despawned, but it is what it is. I'm not super mad about losing a 135. Is that not going to come down? Really? Hang on. Wait, what? Come down here, bro. Are we out of, like, gas or something? Oh, wait, what? Oh, there's too many creatures on it? Oh, no. Okay, hang on. I gotta go fix that. Um, but yeah. Anyway, we'll, we'll try and get that done soon. Guys, I think that's gonna be it for today. Um, my thought is super hurt right now. Obviously, all those Alpha Carno kills, um, didn't really help out. But, um, yeah, we'll get this thing all healed up. We'll make sure that it's healthy. Don't worry. Uh, guys, if you have enjoyed this one, go ahead, do me a favor, hit the like button. If you want to see more like this, subscribe. And, uh, yeah, we'll catch you in the next one.